the Intergovernmental Action Group Against Money Laundry in West Africa, established by the Economic Community of West African States. Say Boko Haram Splinter Group, Islamic State West Africa province, moved about 18 billion naira, which is $36 million, generated from trading and taxing communities in the Lake Chad region through the Nigerian financial system annually. The group, set up by ECOWAS Authority of Heirs of State and Government in 2000, stated that both Boko Haram and Iswap had continued to mobilize, move, and utilize funds through the nation's former financial and commercial system. Wow! It's noted that the government lacks adequate insight into Boko Haram and Iswap international linkages and abuse of the former financial and commercial sectors. He said even though the Department of State Services had significant ability to identify and investigate terrorist financing activities and that it even conducts parallel financial and terrorism investigation, there was little evidence of the effectiveness of such efforts. The group, known as GABA, stated this in its 2021 Mutual Evaluation Report, where it also noted that Nigeria lacked an explicit policy to confiscate proceeds of crime or property of equivalent value, including terrorism financing. It also said the Nigerian government, led by the President Major General Muhammad Buhari, retired, failed to confiscate the assets of terrorists as stipulated in the Global Anti-Money Laundry and Counter-Terrorist Financing Standards. But they will come and say you, they know the international laws concerning repentance uh, terrorists, what they are supposed to do, what they are not supposed to do to them, they will begin to flaunt that. I think uh, the federal government has responded to this and they are so hungry, they are so hard, whatever. This is not a PDPO, this is a, uh, their, uh, their, um, their other colleagues in another, in the same uh, continent, so this is a West African, whatever. They are the one accusing them, uh, they will tell you it is a lie. So you begin to ask yourself, what are they really doing that they will not have a full details of what is going on? They know. And no wonder Malami came out recently to tell you that, uh, tell us that, uh, oh, uh, they, they are still investigating that the reason why they have not been able to name the sponsors of Boko Haram. Uh, they are still investigating. They have to investigate. They have to do whatever before they can do that. You see hypocrisy? But within two hours, they've been able to give us those who are sponsoring Igbo. They know that he has a uh, multiple atm card multiple bank accounts oh they know this they know that <laughs> oh my goodness and they were able to quickly recognize and freeze the accounts uh, of uh, NSAS uh, financiers this present government is a government by the boko haram bandits and kidnappers for the boko haram bandits and kidnappers nigeria is a complete faith state under faith pmb led federal government nigeria governments are the sole sponsor of terrorism in the country Freeze Mazinam the Kano and give us referendum dates. Nigeria is funding terrorism. Buhari cannot fight himself as a grand patron of these terrorist groups. PMB's government is fully involved in their terrorist acts. Funding, shielding, and much more is clearly under full protection and watch of these governments. Buhari and his administration is funding them directly. This is a little compared to what you are about to about the happening of this country under the watch of Buhari. Buhari is not a Nigerian by birth. Buhari failed during head of state. Now he came back to pay back why we know nothing about it. But this generation pays it cost. May God Almighty pay him in hundred ways. Two unfortunates. And we said we have a government in place. Meaning they have backups in government. Of course, you don't know before. And they are busy looking for some Igbo and Namde Kano some sponsors. They've seen themselves, not that they are looking for them. They've seen them. But now take them to court and judge their case. Uh -huh. The hook. And ASCCC exists. Chai, so unfortunate. If they are from the south, they would have stopped it. For, hmm, you would have seen all of them running up and down. They would have stopped it. So that retired Navy Commodore Kunle Olawumi talked about how some political office holders are sponsors of terrorism, but it wasn't taken serious. Now everybody is saying, 
as things are unfolding. You think they are going to take these people serious? They will still sweep this under the carpet. They will say, I beg, forget it. They will wave it off. So they are waiting for this government to confiscate the assets of terrorists. <laughs> they will wait forever. How many governors have asked EFCS, EFCC to help investigate its own government? So ISWAP Northern Relatives move one eighteen billion naira annual revenue through Nigerian financial system and they see demand for one Nigeria. Who cares about what is happening? Hence Nigeria now to save many lives. A house divided against itself cannot stand. Baba gov Baba governments will not and will never Nigeria, why is this that some of you can be easily carried away by sponsor of false and fake news? I've checked and verified the news before giving your conclusions. I think a cool headed and really good Nigeria will think how can you be doing something good and at the same time you use your hand to destroy it? This government now scam. Then use human lives for business and shamelessly then go come back 2023 with more lies to beg for votes. And foolish people go still collect money and vote for them. 18 billion naira laundered in full glare of federal government, DSS, CBN, EFCC, and other related agencies feign ignorance. They feign ignorance. They are all busy destroying South East looking for terrorists. They know exactly what they are doing. They know what they are doing. And that's why you see, they just want to say, they are just selling other narratives. And you must agree that the IPOB, they are, the, they are destroying government properties. They are doing this. They are doing that. It's not possible for them to do that because doing that meaning that they have deviated already and that is why people are suspecting and blaming it on government that they know what is happening can you imagine so we are just under the grace of god in this country and at the mercy of the almighty god this is totally lie and unjustifiable all they say i will say i will say they don't they come saying a lie but they will tell you that uh, nobody's being killed they can still tell you that nobody's being killed in a uh, in in the north Thai. I know idiots like you will come with useless comments. Huh? You'll be mumu. Keep deceiving yourself. I know you will call this a lie and unjustifiable. Anyway, may Allah save us from this calamity. The whole country is it is beyond our imagination and no Messiah can do it except God. I will or no Messiah can do it except God. I will just advise you to stop fooling yourself based on tribalism issue. Yeah, na book in a book in a you say not not lie, not lie. You, they will tell you. Yeah, maybe those people they want to unseat a buari from seat too, because that is that is their own, only language. Ah, they want to remove buari. Why is it that they did not say that? Uh, they did not tell all these uh, northern groups who are now coming out to say that a uh, buari should sack these people that uh, there is insecurity in the north. Why is it that they are not saying it's a lie? 